Greetings, everyone. Welcome back to Bowl Xenogears. We have a landed in a thing. There's a cow. We got cows. Hey, I got all kinds of good stuff here. You need anything? Okay, so we got some shops here. This is kind of like the last shop of the game. Um, we're in we're in the death throes of the game here. Oh, Just in case, if I run across it, I do have to unequip that sword for right now. Those people of Shivan have always dreamed of coming down to live on the planet's surface. I never imagined this world would be how we would realize that dream. This is unbearable. This is not like we're born to die. It's going to happen to us now. Or what's going to happen to us now to this world? We can't carry on without this drinking. It's scary and lonely. It's kind of awfully cold. I hate the cold. It's killing me. If the temperature keeps dropping like this, we'll all be frozen before Deus can finish us off. Burn. Burn. Not this whole world. My home. My whole family. Everything's been destroyed by them. Who cares anymore? Burn it all up! <laughs> so many have died. If this continues, even more will die. It's the same as 500 years ago. That tragedy and hardship is being repeated again. What's going to happen to our world? What's going to happen to us? Ah, burning, burning. All of my rare first edition books and valuable autographs. The supplies are short. I can't believe they're burning my treasures. I better treasures. Suck. Hey, buddy, you need something? Hey, hang on a minute. And there's Xeno Gears. Let's see my weapons. Inflicts power loss? Sign me up. Let's see. And I've got all this crap except for. Alright, so the parts. I want to get two more of those. Now, let's tune it up. Tune up the band, baby. So you've got that. We can get the best engine. So let's get the best engine. Uh, yeah, you, you have the best of everything, so you don't need anything. And you've got that, so you're, you're set. Let's gas it up. Alright, Bart. No. 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 Maybe. Maybe. Yes. Engine. Now. There you go. Actually, if you've got that, just keep that. It's fine. Gas it up. Those two crescents next. No, everybody's good on their armor. I, I don't need the other one. It seems to be like ether defense, so. Top it off! Let's see. Oh. Seems it. Oh, we're running out of money. Um. This is 14. Okay, let's get your new frame. Yes. Yeah, you don't need armor. Alright, so let's do that. She still needs a new engine, though, so we're out of money. Yay! Yeah, money's gonna be a, uh, a hot commodity right now. Thanks. Come again. I'll give you a better deal. Yeah, better you than me. <laughs> I 
actually, it's been with items as such. More of these drives. These all need to go on dock because his hit points are just armor. <laughs> Aren't these picatiles cute? They're going cheap, cheap too. How about it? You buy my picatiles? Just buy them. All right, twenty thousand gold for the lock. No haggling for discounts. Pay up. Forced to pay twenty thousand gold. Thanks. They're really delicious if you grill them. Ah! Oh, uh, you getting your freaking money back? No, nothing! Nothing! Alright, Schultz! Anyways... We get access to this elevator now. Where does this go? Oh, we got some cool stuff we gotta go get around. Fam. So, this takes us back to the choo-choo place. This is that strange old Grandpa Choo-Choo's precious treasure. What happened to him when Shavak crashed down to Earth? I haven't seen him. See, I don't know why Shavak crashed. I don't understand this yet. This treasure. Can we just take it? I'm sure you won't mind if we just borrow it. Vivid Turban. Receives some speed shoes. Speed shoes sound nice. Doc, do you have another broken thing? Let's find out. Half time between turn. Oh my gosh. That is literally one of the best items I've seen in this game. Oh my gosh. Faye, you take this. <laughs> oh dear, Faye. I think you're going to be giving Doc a run for his money now in terms of like speed. I mean, geez. Just borrowing it. Just borrowing it. Hey, it's not like we're grave robbers or anything, right? So hex us or haunt us, okay? Please, we're, we're begging you. A hero costume. Hercules ring. Okay, so that could be some new armor for Faye. Thanks percent more of that. Fence down when ally Kato can. Well, my allies won't go down, so I'm going to gain 52 defense. Alright, I think there's like one more. Some treasures around here. The auto belt, I don't care. Those are, Those are nice. Huh? There's a bunch of little kids' toys all lined up. Well, this takes such things we don't even know what's going to happen in this world. Okay, I think that's everything. Yeah. Okay, let's get out of here. Hey, welcome. What can I do for you today? Hey. Items. Do I have any, like, eyeballs and crap? Things. Ivory. Yeah, I guess a little bit of Oh, wait. I gotta see what she's actually selling. I mean, come on, Spets. Hit the buy button. Power wave! Look at that. Godson ammo. Okay, so we got Bart, his. one of his last weapons. So let's equip him and the mech. 
Just how much more we can afford. Ivari. So you know what? I'd rather keep that information silent. Power boss. Now this base is the last refuge for humans. As you know about see, we have almost no supplies. We were using a fallen piece of Shafat as the main base. You probably could have guessed that, huh? If we could take our dais even one day sooner, we can't hold out much longer like this. Ava Kislev Nisa, we've been feuding for such a long time, but finally we are coming together as one like this. It's probably already too late. It's always the case. By the time we notice anything, it's way too late. How could we possibly stand to a god's army? The situation's really hopeless. Here. I'm a celebrated gear weapon specialist, but lately there's been no interesting work. There are no men with enough guts to ask me to forge them a weapon to fight Deus. If you bring me a nifty sword, I can forge it to something truly amazing for you any time. But I won't work for anyone rude enough to ask me to check a weapon while they're still equipped to their gear. Oh, the Keishin! You sure have a novel sword. Looks interesting. Let me take a peek. Came out great. It was like turning plowshares into a sword. Use this sword and make Deus and his legions pay. Keishin's sword was enhanced. Received Keijin's sword. Now we have the best weapon for Heimdall or Fenrir or whatever you call it. So let's see how much this makes Doc broken now. Holy crap, Doc. Okay, he's almost as powerful as he appears. <laughs> Jeez, man! Doc! What the frick, man? Time to turn around, you're going like frickin' like overkill. Anyways, that's that area. Now. whole base. I do not remember this at all. You do. There's nothing here! It's long gone already. Wow, to make a hole this big. Okay, so that's where Faye broke out of jail. I guess I wasn't supposed to have used this. I'm sorry I caused you so much trouble. Your little brother was really mad at me. He asked us whether we had hearts or not. I mean, having a brother with enough guts to be honest. Why? We don't speak cats. I have a stupid son, you know. He used to fish for a living, but one day he said he caught, saw a merman sitting on, on the city floor. Since then he hasn't gone out to sea. He's become a landlubber. I haven't seen him these past few years. I don't 
don't know what he's doing now. Hey, you have a rare stone there too. Is it a mermaid's tear? They're tough to find. The Southern War one was a good luck charm. I wonder if there's a girl out there to fit, fit to wear your stone. I guess he's maybe talking about the uh, pendant necklace that I'm wearing. That used to be Sophia's. Done. Here. It's not bad. A lot of people. It's fun to play in the snow. We're losing our home in Kislev. We lost our home in Ava too. So we decided to stay here for a while. But next time, we'll have to live somewhere that's green. I never thought I'd live here. Wouldn't make my parents happy. Got that cat out of the way. Is that the door? No. I like this house because there are a lot of cats. Kitties have lived through the the, the dune with all. It's all Chronos cats. I don't know why, but recently families keep increasing. I wasn't planning on living here. My son's family is with me. A hard time if I could because my daughter begged us to take all the cats with us. This isn't bad at all compared to the military camp and the cat house. It's tremendously lonely without cats. And they're right, Speed. You know. Good boy. Gently purring and laying in my lap in the prison dorm. See. Frickin' Dan slapped a mess out of his supper. Oh, Queen, what do you see with those eyes? That look, that look of sorrow as if you've lost something. And within that, there lies a kindness which for, would forgive all. We are to be judged. The last day is nigh. You too should be careful. It's all according to prophecy. Yeah, whatever, stupid. That's why I thought I could ride the UFO. It's not flying anymore. On top of that, this guy keeps saying all his stuff. Yahoo! Well, they're all sliding around. That's why I thought Prince Bartholomew would return and bring peace to the land of Ava. Just goes to show, you never know what might happen in this world. I've heard rumors that a part of Norton, the old capital of Kislev, survived. I wonder if they're still conducting that barbaric bartending thing. Really, I ask you. What are we to do with our men menfolk these days? Yeah, you can actually go back to Kislev, uh, yeah, Kislev and, uh... Hey, I was a little scared, but not really scared, because I knew that inside of that monster, you were doing all you could to fight it, Faye. I knew it. Hey, Midori, I suppose you've ever talked. Midori! Hey, I better give this back to you. It's your precious ring, right? Be good, little girl. This is your mother to Yui, alright, Midori? Oh, man. Look after Dan for me, okay? Yep, we are all fine. Faye, you be careful too. I'm sure your voice will reach her too, Faye. Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay, well, I'm going now. See you later. Here, I got this from Choo Choo. Faye, you can have it. I'll trade you for my ring. Hercules ring. So that's a second part Hercules ring. You little scumbag. In the prison, when I saw you change into a monster, I understood everything. Looking inside of you, Faye, there's a monster that's not you. He's the bad one. He's the blame. So, to forgive you or not to forgive you, well, that's not the problem. It's not like I'm going to turn back things. It's going to turn back things the way they were, but it's just... I don't know how to say it properly, but I'm sorry. I... I... 
It's all right, Dave. Enough already. I understand. It is my fault. I'm sorry I caused you such pain. I'm just glad that I could finally make peace with you. Take care, kiddo. You're a dick. Alright. There's another hallway down. Let's check the next one. Alright, so that's like the last thing I really wanted to do here. Yep. That's it. So let's go find Queenie, talk to her. GTFO. Remember, I think she's found treasure over here. Okay, so that guy, you give him like a gold nugget and a gold bullion, he gives you a music box where you can listen to all the tracks of the game. So that's what he does. What? Okay, we're done here. We are not done here yet. Okay, that's where I came out. Uh, I didn't see the queen. Did you guys see the queen? Who's supposed to be in here? Oh! Wait, this is doofus. Never mind. Crap. Go back. I know where the queen is. Back here. Falling, softly covering up everything in this world. Not with sorrow, not with defilement, not with mistakes. If only we could wipe away these things as easily as that. What have we, what have I been doing, been pursuing for these past 500 years? By the way, I was the person you rescued from my karma. I had to recover consciousness. Yes, well, at first, he had lost faith in himself, but now he is better. Carr has revived himself, and has found some real meaning in his life. If he decides to fight on our side, then our total fighting power shall be greatly increased. Oh, you finally snapped out of it, you buffoon. Carr, please listen to me. Right now, we must forget about being friend or foe. We all must support one another, regardless. Right now, we need your help. I am just trash. A reject. Stop feeling sorry for yourself and pull yourself together, man. Yuga, what are you? Trash. Reject. You can take pity and call yourself that all you want. What about them? Are these women stupid or trash? Or rejects too for believing in you? The reasons why you helped the girls, who had no one to turn to, may not have been that noble. But in spite of that, they stuck with you. Do you know why? They know you better than anyone else. They know the true kindness that exists inside your heart. They know because they want to be loved. That is why they won't leave you. Carr, do not make them into the trash or rejects that you speak of. Commander! All of you. Needless to say, you are not trash or a reject. We know that better than anyone does. I... I didn't realize that what I've been looking for was so close to me. I'm sorry for not realizing sooner. Oh, Commander! I mean, hey, we get the elementals and him on our side. That's like a pretty good power boost. We'll have the freaking Megazord with us. That'd be awesome. 
So much has happened between him and I. When this battle ends, I want to face Francis one-on-one -on -one in sport, not war, as a martial artist. I am sure he wishes the same thing, too. Perhaps. Faye, may I ask you something? About Ellie. What if, even if we break Zohar's spell, she doesn't return to normal? We'll be back to her usual self. I will go on believing that. Even if that doesn't happen, I'm still... Well, let's just say I'm prepared for that, too. You don't have to do this if you don't want to, you know. Your opponent's the person you love. If you decide to quit now, no one will blame you. Quit would be meaningless. All that I fought for, and all that I live for, would come to have no meaning at all. People should be free. No one bound by others. No one binding others. Inside of me, there's a part of me that desires that freedom. And a part of me that gives me hope. So I shall fight to win true freedom. For we are still alive. We fight to live. That is the reason why I fight. It's proof I'm human. I promised my father, and myself too, that I would free Ellie from Deus Binds, that I would save her. I understand. So let's keep believing and hope for a miracle. My dear queen, peace! Woohoo! Oh. Yahoo! Yonk! Now we can leave here. We are done with this place. I don't really know if we're almost done with the video. Woohoo! But now we got side quest, baby. We ain't going to the final dungeon. Uh-uh. 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 Oh god, there's like four places for side quests. Okay. Alright, let's get on the Yggdrasil. Which is somehow still active. But first! We need to change party members. I'm going to do this one first. Because this one is, uh... I don't want to do. So Faye should be able to learn all of his new... ...techs. And we're gonna go do her, uh, her side quest. Come on, you should know who it is. Alright, Oh gosh, she's doing a thing. Young bastard, you better not die, promise me! Of course, we're not gonna die. Quit saying such weird stuff. Sorry. Yeah, you're right. You'll make it back. When you come back, I'm going to... Well, I just thought... Maybe I could be closer to you, you know? Hey, whoa! Quit it! You know what you're saying! <laughs> just kidding. Young Master, you're all panicked. <sighs> Funny. I don't see Choo Choo anywhere. Where'd she go off to? Nobody cares, Margie. It's Choo Choo. Alright, so Everaldo, you're in the party. Yaha! And I'll end the video when we get over to where we need to be. Uh, or, so, yeah. Anyways, um. Yeah, we're in the final stage of the game. He's gonna get the rest of his stuff for the job. Uh, we'll take this off and then I'll is it? Smack by it. There it is. Okay. Oh.
pain she really did. What the frick was that? We just had the tip of my thumb. It wasn't like shooting through my thumb. Hit the button in the wrong spot. Pinched a nerve, I think. <laughs> hey, why am I laughing? Oh. It's not good, Spets. You don't even laugh about crap like that. Oh, that's right. There's a card game I could have played, but I didn't see no pain with the eyes. Day is integrated with Zohar in a world. But we found out Deus is in the center of a giant structure created out of the fallen Merkava. The only way we can think of to destroy Deus is to penetrate into there and make our way to the center. That structure used to be Merkava itself. But we must assume that inside it has changed significantly. We don't know what dangers await inside of there. Please be careful. Yeah, thanks, Sigurd. Let me take care of it. Destroy Deus. Even if it cost me everything I have. Hey, you sure about this? Bart? I know what you must be thinking now. You destroyed Deus. The proliferation of the nano machines that are out to turn this planet itself into a weapon will stop. If you end up losing Ellie, you must unite with Deus for that very purpose. Good will be. But. That's right, Faye. She's our friend. She's been through a lot with us, too. I think that saving a dear friend is just as important as protecting our planet or saving the world. No better reason is there to fight. If you can't even save your friends, then how could you save the world? Don't you agree? Yeah, Sig's right. Don't ever give up, Faye, no matter what! Only one can release Ellie from Day's spell and find true love on the battlefield. Give you as much backup as we can, so. Thanks a lot, Bart, Sigur. I won't give up. You volunteered to fight for the young master and the rest of us. So it's our turn to fight for you and Ellie. Let's go, Fred. To gain true freedom. Shall we launch the Idrisil? Go ahead. Move forward, impulse power. So the weird thing is, is that ah, here we go. Crap! I did not mean to hit the square button. I was thinking I was flying the airship in Final Fantasy VI, which is how you make it go into slow mode. We can strafe with it. I just want to land next to this. Is this too wrong? Is it too wrong, game? Ah, here we go. Alright. So next time on Xeno Gears, we'll be exploring the lighthouse, and I'll get you then. Later.